How you doing, CPAC? At this weekend's Conservative Political Action Conference, top Republican influencers railed against government efforts to get Americans vaccinated. They were hoping, the government was hoping, that they could sort of sucker 90% of the population into getting vaccinated, and it, and, and it, and it isn't happening, right? There, there's a... Applause for anti-vaccine rhetoric comes at a time when much of the country is losing ground against the Delta variant, the now dominant strain of COVID-19 in the U.S. The biggest surge in hospitalizations is mostly in Southern and Republican states. It's horrifying. I mean, they're cheering about someone saying that it's a good thing for people not to try and save their lives. The country's seven-day moving average is climbing, now to over 20,000 cases. Our healthcare system in Southwest Missouri, we are absolutely stretched um, uh, further than we were stretched last year. In Missouri, almost every new infection is occurring in unvaccinated people. Without protection against the Delta variant, all bets are off. We'll do everything that we can to, to help you get back home to your family. But the reality is you may not go home. Sweetening the shot has worked in some areas. This Oregon University student is the latest American to win a million dollars for getting the vaccine. I never imagined that. But a jackpot isn't enough to convince the majority. The president's chief medical advisor says that may mean more drastic measures. The local level, there should be more mandates. There really should be. We're talking about life and death situation. We've lost 600,000 Americans already and we're still losing more people. And that will continue to happen if vaccination rates don't improve. Daily COVID counts are rising in 35 states.